Did you know that with the change of season often comes the change of our sleep habits too? And it's so true, if we lack sleep, our bodies really show. For example, our immune system suffers greatly. The other thing, we get headaches, we'll become cranky, our mood changes, and we may have muscle aches and pains that are unexplained otherwise. Now, of course, all of us have experienced sleepless nights for whatever reason, whether it's a new baby or you're experiencing stress. So we want to, at Wallace for Wellness, stock your toolbox with things that you can do to help naturally sedate you so that you're going to be feeling better. One thing, of course, as a massage therapist, make sure you get your regular massage therapy treatments because that helps to induce parasympathetic nervous system and helps to keep you rested and feeling better. Exactly, we could even look at your sleep environment. Is it dark? Is it quiet? Have you not watched TV right before going to bed? Those are things that'll definitely help too. Of course, and of course, exercise is another really important thing to do. We want to make sure we're exercising on a regular basis, but be, sure, be careful about when you're exercising. You don't want to come home at the end of your day and an hour before or bed start to exercise. That's not a good idea. So make sure you're fitting in exercise earlier in the day. The other thing are supplements. Some people take their vitamins right before they go to bed, but you have to be careful and read your ingredients really carefully because anything with a B complex can actually act as a stimulant. That's right, so make sure you check with your naturopath when taking supplements because especially if you're suffering from sleep disturbances. Now another thing that you want to think about is your caffeine intake. Now we all like a cup of joe in the morning and that's fine. However, try to avoid caffeine after noon hour. And also with alcohol, you want to stop drinking alcohol two or three hours before going to bed if you're having trouble sleeping. Exactly. Things like a hot bath, our grandmother always talked about it, but they really do work. An Epsom salt bath is an excellent thing to do. Maybe doing some of the relaxation, breathing, some meditation before you go to bed instead of the exercise. That's true. Now, of course, we all often crave a nice hot drink before bedtime. So rather than grab for a cup of coffee or even a cup of tea, why not have a caffeine-free herbal tea? My family loves traditional medicinals because it's safe, it's effective, they use medicinal grade therapeutic herbs, which can really make a difference. And one of our favorites in our household is organic nighty night. And as it suggests, nighty night, it really does help with sleep. The other tea that's great is the organic chamomile and lavender. Lavender is very soothing for the body, so that also helps for people to go to sleep too. That's right. And of course, socially, a nice cup of tea before bed, the ability to chat with family and friends really helps to induce your parasympathetics and you'll be sleeping better in no time.